Sorry, I need to really quickly read this. Lord de Resides has then followed the automation inside. After going through what felt like a maze, they emerged in an underground section of the studio. This is pretty sick. Is this where Ren was doing her shenanigans? In Zero? What is this place? It's incredible. Rosenberg's studio. Yeah, it's Pat Matter. Is that it? The giant archaism you mentioned before? Yeah, Ren used it back at the Sun Fort. I believe she called it Pather Matter. So this is where it's been. The hell's all this mechano crap doing down here anyway? I thought this was supposed to be a doll studio. I believe those terminals are connected to the horrible network. This must have been where Kitty was remotely hacking the network. Well, what is it you want? Yo, 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 what's poppin'? Mr. 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 Jor, thank you for allowing us to come in and speak with you. We had a few questions we were hoping to ask. Would they by any chance happen to be about what Campanella was up to? So you know. Don't misunderstand. You're correct that I have ties to the society. In the end, however, I am nothing more than a humble doll maker. I'm not directly involved with whatever grand scheme they have planned. So, in other words, you can't tell us exactly what Campanella is plotting to do? I don't know, nor am I in any position to. However, you should understand that he is an enforcer, not an anguist. He's not authorized to propose plans for the society to pursue. The anguists, rather, are the ones who draft such arrangements. Now, just hold on a minute. This is a little too much to take in all at once. I just like a lot of things in this game. Isn't this insider information? Should you really be giving it to us so easily? <laughs> it's hardly confidential. There are many on the continent who know of this already. The church, the guild, the intelligence agencies, and the major powers. And even that is alone, even that is only scratching the surface. The society is so widely known, yet you still are able to freely continue making dolls here. As I said, I'm not in a position to know all of the society's inner workings. Take the Archaisms, for example. Their construction relies on technologies from many other workshops besides this one. A studio is but one skill on the ever-coiling serpent, which is why the church and guild will never set foot in here without due cause. I suppose that makes sense. Someone like you is more valuable while you're still attached to the snake, which makes you a handy source of info. Correct. That being said, the studio has already been preemptively outfitted for any contingencies. Even should you break the front door down with an arrest warrant, all you would find is an empty and meager doll studio. Nothing more. Not even patter matter. Well, would you like to try your hand at taking me into custody? Having heard all of that? You may not have another chance. No, that's not why we're here. You made your point. I'd like to inquire further if you're willing to answer. I guess that's all we can do, but it doesn't mean I like it. A wise decision? I take it you'd like to know something more concrete than veiled statements and broad outlines. Narrow your questions down to three, and I'll answer them if I can. Fair enough. What three things should we ask him about? Well, <laughs> we're gonna have to ask him about all of this. So, I mean, ideally, we ask him about all of this. Ooh, nice imagery. Weissman in the middle. I don't know the person all the way to the right. The person on the left, I don't know either. I don't. I only know, uh, what's his name? Weissman here. The Anguis. They are the seven snake apostles who live and serve to realize the Grandmaster's plan. Oh well, yeah, Ouroboros is like based on a snake, isn't it? It's like mythology. It's like, it's like a mythological snake or something. That's really cool. Even I do not know all of their identities. However, I'm aware of the anguish that will be arriving in Crossbow before long. Is there any way you can tell us more about them? 
One is a man, the six anguish to be precise. He leads the 13 factories that comprise Ouroboros' technological network. He's a society's greatest irritation, an engineer with an insatiable appetite. Needless to say, he's a contemptible man. You clearly have a high opinion of him. Just how contemptible are we talking? He's the sort of man who carries for nothing but satisfying in his own intellectual curiosity. Ouroboros is the snake that eats itself infinitely. Yeah, I figured it had something to do with a snake. Like, I remember hearing that somewhere, that it had something to do with a snake. We met the guy in the lab coat? I don't remember him. I'm not sure what he hopes to achieve by coming to this land in person, but I can say this for certain. His arrival is anything but good news for Crossbell. We'll take your word for it. He will not be alone, however. The seventh anguish, the Steel Maiden, will also be coming to Crossbell. The Steel Maiden? That's got an ominous ring if I've ever heard, ever heard one. She's an enigma, to say the least. Briefly put, she's a masterful warrior whom you have no hope of defeating, even if you were to face her all at once. She's that strong? Trying to wing man your fellow conspirators, I see. It was merely a word of warning. Unlike the six anguists, I've heard the seventh anguist is a virtuous individual. However, were you to face her unprepared, it would surely cost you your lives. Steel Maiden might have been mentioned in Cold Steel. Because that title sounds very familiar. But obviously, she would be in Crossbell. Because Cold Steel 2 and Crossbell, or Azure, happened at the same time. As I already told you, even I am not familiar with the details. From what little I've heard in passing, however, I do know what it's called. The Phantasmal Blaze Plan, I know what that is. Now there's a name rife with symbolism. This plan doesn't entail causing some of sort of widespread incident in Crossbell, like the one in Liberal last year. That can't be. There's no way we can just let that happen. Stop making me repeat myself. I don't know the details. What I can tell you is that the society's intervention here pales in comparison to what happened in the world. The society prefers to operate from the shadows above all else. They aren't the type to make their move on the surface. Is that supposed to make us feel better? Because it sure as hell ain't working. Seconded. The fact that you can give us nothing but a name makes whatever they're doing all the more suspect. Listen to the cult? As far as I know, the two sides never had any direct ties. Having said that, it's the fact that the society was the one that destroyed the lodge where Ren was being held. You're referring to paradise, right? My understanding is that the cult used to lure in and exploit influential individuals from around the continent. In all likelihood, it was brought down because it began to target influential individuals the society was bank backing. Banking? It's not in short of a miracle that Ren survived that place. That hellhole deserved to get wiped out, but it's not like that makes Ouroboros the good guys either. I hope you didn't expect that explanation to win us over. As I said, I'm only telling you what I know. Take it how you will. That makes three questions I've answered. You've taken enough of my time. I'm gonna have to ask that you leave now. But, that seems fair enough though. Fine, that's what we agreed to, so we'll be going for now. Would you mind if we return for another one of these talks? If I feel so inclined, also fair. Keep the following in mind. It's not only Ouroboros that you should have your sights set on. There are other forces to be cautious of in the wake of Crossbow's bid for independence, wouldn't you say? I guess so. Man's got a point. Sounds like you probably know a thing or two about that too. Maybe so, maybe not. Off you go. Follow the little one like you did on your way here. If you wander off, I can't guarantee your safety. Oh, maybe I am thinking of the Lance Maiden. They both have Maiden in their name. In their titles. I feel like I just came out of a bad dream. The Phantasmal Blaze Plan and the two Anguists making their way to Crossbell to enact it? It's so fantastical, I can barely bring myself to believe it. Just how dangerous are they? From what I've heard about the Libero incident, very. We can't take the threat they pose lightly. 
Still, if what the maester told us is true, whatever they're planning in Crossbow isn't as extensive as it were in the Burl. That'd be a relief. I hear they had an enormous battleship to contend with. Not to mention that giant archaism, Pattern Matter. Where'd you get that info? The first division has it all labeled as classified. Don't tell me you hear about these kinds of things while working as a host, too. My lips are sealed. Oh, Wazi. Is something wrong, you two? Well, yeah, just a little. Tia Tot might be able to explain it better than I could, you mind? I'll make an attempt. Having seen the automation that guided us in and out of the studio, it's become clear the society is far more mischievous than they are malevolent. Mischievous? Yes, they have more technological prowess than both the Epstein Foundation and Zeiss Central Factory, yet squander it by choice. Consider the research necessary to develop pattern matter, it would have been more practical to use those same resources to build 50 airships. You think so? Perhaps they have a source of funding, one deeper than we may realize? Maybe, but whether you're an army or a crime syndicate, efficiency is typically the highest priority of any organization. Recreation typically doesn't have much of a place there, if at all, but Ouroboros turns all of that right on its head. That makes their motives and rationale all the more baffling to me. Stick the words right out of my mouth. The thing about it though is no matter how many anguish and archaisms they've got hiding up their sleeves, the Red Constellation and Hayui are probably more of an actual threat, realistically speaking. And that even taking into account whatever the Empire and Republic are up to. That's true. Put all four of them into one autonomous state together, and you got a dis disaster waiting to happen. The kitchen already has too many cooks without the society. The big question is what do they plan to bring to the table? Who's to say, even back in the terrorists at the trade conference was allegedly a complete whim on their part. They don't seem to have any interest in involving themselves with conventional power struggles. In that case, would that make that would that make what they are working toward as unconventional as everything else they do? That would mean we're completely in over our heads trying to do something, do anything about it. Words. All we can say for sure is that whatever it is, it can't be given for Crossbell. At any rate, we should return home for now. I want to relay all of this to the chief. After that, we should do the same for the CGF and the guild. Regardless of what the society's after, the least we can do is make sure we're ready for them. I agree. Good call. Back to the city we go. My throat. Alright, Ouroboros is finally really... I mean, they were already making their appearance, but now, now they're weaving their way into the story a bit. So we're going to see two of the Anguises here, which will be... Maybe two. The seventh one is on their way. That'll be really interesting to see, seeing who the seventh Anguis is. And the sixth one. Apparently, I should know the sixth one, but I do not remember the sixth one. Like, at all. Oh, my Enigma. Who could it be? I get the feeling someone's in need of our services. Lloyd. Thank goodness I finally got a hold of you. Oh, hi, friend. Have you been trying to get in contact with us for a while? I have, but for some reason none of my calls were able to get through. I even tried everyone else's enigmas, but they were a total no-go, too. There must have been an orbital wave jammer in the basement of the studio. Sorry about that. We ended up wandering out of signal range. What's going on? Do you have an urgent support request for us? Not quite, no. Half an hour ago, there was a train on... There was a train derailment on West Crossbow Highway. No. A what? Are you serious? I wish I wasn't. The second division is en route to investigate the scene. The CGF's on its way too, so there's probably no need for you to go. But I figured they should keep you guys in the loop just to be safe. Got it. Thanks for telling us, friend. If you find out more, let us know as soon as you can. Roger that. Is something the matter? Your friend has something important to tell us. Well... What the hell? A derailment? It just went right off the tracks? Yeah, Fran said the 2nd Division and CGF are on their way there, so we could probably leave it to them. Then again... It would be hard to turn away from something so concerning. I'll say. The timing's a little too suspicious for my tastes. I have my doubts that this was just a mere accident. What should we do? We have until the end of the day to report on what we've learned about the society. For now, let's go to the scene of the accident. We can't overlook the possibility that some sort of foul play was involved, whether from a cryptid or otherwise. At the very least, we can lend a hand investigating the crash site. 
Agreed. We should hurry. Probably best to take our new ride if we're looking to get there ASAP. Righto, Randy, old buddy of mine. Where's the where's the car? I just realized it shows you where the car is on the map. <laughs> Which is good game design. So if you forgot where you put the car, you can just go to it. Do you hear that? Those are sirens. Oh, this is really spook. Three ambulances. Do you suppose they were transporting those who were injured from the derailment? Given the timing, I wouldn't doubt it. Cecile and the rest of the hospital are going to have a long day ahead of them. In the meantime, we have to get to the scene of the accident. Roger. Which is West Crosswell Highway, I think it said? First take me... Oh, they won't even let me go though. Oh, the garage is right here, that's why. There's been a train accident off the West Crossbow Highway. I don't know where in the crossbow highway to go. Probably like... Oh, train derailment site. More facets of good game design. Thank you, Falcon. Those buses just now? They look like the ones used to carry people traveling to and from the Republic. They must be transporting the rest of the passengers that were on the train. Damn, what a shit show. It makes me wonder how extensive the scale of the accident is. It makes you wonder indeed, huh? Lloyd, you guys made it. Hey, Franks, so you're on this case, too. Hello there, Noel, Brandy, thank you both for coming as well. Of course, good to see you, Dahlia. Looks like we're in the right place. What's the situation? I'm right, the Bayels and the police are currently investigating the scene of the accident. Inspector Donovan and Detective Raymond from the 2nd Division are leading our department's efforts. From what I can tell, it looked like a mess. The train went clean off the tracks. It's gonna take a long time to get things cleared and repaired. And what are the passengers? No fatal, no fatalities, thank, thank the goddess, but a few were in the critical condition. Those most in need of medical attention were carried away by ambulance a little while ago. Yeah, we saw them on our way here. And the other passengers, they were transferred to buses for the remainder of their trip. Yeah, there was one round of them arranged for passengers headed for Crosswell City and another one for going to Altair. It was chaos sorting it all out. I can imagine. It's not every day you have to go to damage control for an accident to sit here. Speaking of which, we should make our way to the scene ourselves. Are we clear the pass through? Yeah, you should be good to go. I doubt anyone's gonna complain. Feel free to head on in whenever you're ready. Guess we have another section of the Knox Road or whatever. Never mind, I got that chest already. 